Wub, wub, wub. All right, I'm just going to get started right away since I don't have that much time. I do have to play volleyball and leave and wrap up my knees in one hour, so let's go. After the harrowing encounter with the prospector, you gathered yourself and continued onwards. Let me see. The air grew thick with moisture. The buzzing and chirping of insects drowned out the sound of your footfalls. You beheld the wetlands. Blood card? Pick a card. I have two items here. I want to see what this is, but this looks like one of the special ones, and then I'll get a blood one later, so it really doesn't matter. And I don't think I want to buff anybody. I'm gonna go this way. The watchable bullfrog, it leaps in the way of attacking flyers. I don't know what this mushroom thing is. Porcupine. Rat King. These are the cards I have. I have a bullfrog, as it is. I have a porcupine, no. Don't I? I don't. I wonder if the alpha buffs also... Nope, it doesn't buff the the pokey power, but I think I like the idea of getting four bones out of one Rat King. But who are the players that can use bones? Stinkbug, Possum, Alpha. I'm gonna get this. No idea what this is. Came across a familiar, you came across some familiar stones, but there's something different. You intuited that the fate of the creature selected for this would not be pleasant. <laughs> Do what you must? Nope. Hi TJ, hello! Welcome to the stream where my face is only gonna appear when I scream. But I don't know what this thing does, so I kinda just wanna put a wolf down. Which, I only have one wolf. I don't know if that's a good thing. Long time no chat, we've been seeing houses like every afternoon. You are allowed to send me the, the houses that you like, because I like looking at them and seeing what the market's like, since I'm looking at houses myself, except I'm kind of half serious about it. But I don't know what this thing does, so I'm going to put down the wolf. You callously slaughter the wolf. However, the Bone Lord was pleased by your sacrifice. What is this? A minor boon of the Bone Lord, you will start each extra battle with one extra bone. So this is a boon that I sacrificed a wolf in. I think that was probably not a great move. You shook off the viscera of the poor wolf and carried onwards. Hopefully I get another wolf. I probably made a bad and terrible decision. This game has autosave. Bone. Un bone. Look. There's a third talking card somewhere around here. Personally, I hate the guy. Biggest killjoy ever, but he's the only one of us with a plan to get things back to normal. So there's a lot of lore in this game, and... You might behoove you to watch the first one just to get some of the lore, but it's a very interestingly framed game, and I appreciate the deck building aspect and the strategy building. They're not throwing everything at the wall at once, so that is good. I do need the bullfrog out at some point. Is it spooky? It's spooky in the sense of the atmosphere, but there's not like jump scares or Scary shit. At least not yet. The objective is to get five more kills than the other. 
Um, I forgot about a lot of the strategy in this game. I'm also very dumb. You sure? Bitch as sure as I have to be, because you got to kill these two, and then I'm going to get one damage over here. Oh, I didn't kill them. Because I just glanced right over them. Because they flip over. Gotta hate that shit. Greetings! I only have but one bone. This'll do two. I will net three. I will net two. The bullfrog will die. I will get a bone. Okay. Oh, did I just win? I just won! I'm good at math. I'm really good at math. So the objective is to get five more teeth or five more attacks than the other side. It's just sometimes I don't understand some of the sigils and how that acts. Bone or blood? If you have any questions about what the symbols mean, but it does take some time getting used to. I think I have plenty of cards that have... Actually, I don't have anything that has three blood. One, two, three. Yeah, let me do a three blood one. Grizzly. I get to sacrifice a card and make a new card type of thing. All right. The choice is yours. Am I traveling for the holidays this year? I'm traveling in December and coming back in mid-January. Uh, it, would, it would be nice to have the alpha sigil on somebody that doesn't require five bones. Who could I give it to? Somebody cheap. Skink. With the alpha card or the wolf? I have a wolf? I'm trying to figure out when your next New York visit will be. Anything that has to do with work at all? I want somebody that will last a while. Maybe. Imagine if I put it on a grizzly. That would be amazing. But it's so hard to get the grizzly out on the field. <laughs> I'll go. He wants it. Hello. Buff and debuff at the same time is pretty stinky. There are lots of things that you can go for, but they're all pretty optional. And it's also just a lot of work just, just to travel during these times, honestly. All right, so, yeah, all right. Salutations! What are they gonna put out? Fish that fly over a coyote that does two damage. This person will come back to me. Worker ants score well. I'll have enough to put down the stink bug because of the two thing there. Where do I want to put the worker ant? Who is gonna die if I put it here? Off to the side for now. The stink bug will make the coyote weaker by one, so it could last enough hits. And then I have to hold off the sack to. Death. 
take me. Oh, and you won't die. Except I won't advance here. To leave it. I'm taking a minus one right now. I kind of want to do two squirrels. But I want to see if th this person won't get damaged, though. So hmm. I have to figure this out. Probably not a great strategy on my part. Because now this card is never going to die. Possum with two bones. I'm gonna do four damage to their three, so I just really have to write it out. Unless he gets hit. Oh, he's dead. But my ant is back. Put the ant back on the board and just win the game? Yeah, put the ant back on the board and win the game. What is this thing that looks like a computer that's not a computer that's like a tombstone? You encountered a small outpost in the woods tended by a mysterious woman. It was the traitor that the old trapper had mentioned. Her appearance was unsettling, but you were mollified by her offerings. Do you mind if I examine those belts of yours? Let's start with your hair pelts. Here's what I can offer. You can trade you any of these. Take your time. Yo, this skunk is kind of stinky in a good way, but I need a mantis. I need the bifurcated strike. Is that a, a golden pelt magnificent? I want my strange larva back. But I also need this child that never dies, so I can keep sacrificing this card. I need it. These pelts are most excellent, my thanks. My thanks! Forgot. One item I need. I'd rather go this way so I have stuff that I can choose, but then I don't get any of the card combination stuff. I could buff my card. I think I'm gonna buff a card. Oh, this is plus two heart. This is different. The crackling fire lit the starving faces of a group of survivors. We have not food, one said. But perhaps one of your creatures will join us? Enhance it, health, said another? Please no. Um. Child, my child, stay alive longer. The fire warmed the weary child 13 and enhanced its health. You suspect that the intentions of the survivor were less, survivors were less than pure. With your child 13 in tow, you retreated into the woods. Mantis, mantis. So I need to put the mantis here. Save that for later. Put the squirrel down. Put mantis down. Bifurcated strike. Then attack here, attack here. We'll get that. This is a raven egg, which I want to kill as soon as I can. It has two health. I could put the stink bug here down. It'll take two turns to kill this motherfucker. Uh, but I can also sacrifice it later and make it less than powerful if it does evolve into something that can fly over me. Uh, I can't kill
kill it yet, though. So I'm going to do two damage plus one, which is three, and they will do one, two on me, so plus one. Uh, I'll, I want to try to take out this thing as fast as possible. But cracking! I just don't know if the health will evolve. Hi, Mike! Did regain a health. Shit. I just have to do damage right now. The problem is, is that my stink bug is gonna die. I could have, I could have sacrificed that, but I didn't. Stink bug? Oh, it flew right over my stink bug. I'm very smart. Are you doing anything tonight? Are you doing an open play? get rid of my card yet. I will do four damage and win, but I won't get anything over. So what if I, you are doing an open play, come to gym bar after. <laughs> I can do this and do four damage, but I'm really stuck if I take these three out. So I don't really have a route unless I do wolf there and take out one, two. And I'm still only doing the same amount. I would be doing five damage. Hold up. You wish you could be in the cheer section for me? No visitors, unfortunately. I needed that bonus tooth. I didn't need it, but I wanted it. Rattler, Rat's King, which I already have, River Otter, which would attack but not get attacked afterward. Do I have any other three damage cards? Not really. Where would River Otter be useful? I already have a Rat King. Six bones is a lot though. And so that means like this will be a, a late play for me. Which doesn't really seem like it's worth it. I don't know if I need more single blood. I know I think it is important to have single blood cards out here, but I have one, two, three, four, five, six. Six out of my fourteen cards. Kind of reasonable. I don't know, it's just not that strong though. I mean, in health. Do I need an item? Probably need an item. I only get to pick one though. Whirl or goat? I want both. Godspeed, this is a boss fight.
The mud tugged hard at your feet, forcing you to slow your pace. A rank odor caused your stomach to churn, eyes to water. Was the rotting fish that hung from the branches around you? A huge man approached. Go fish. The angler, mind his hook, play a squirrel, or something when he aims it. That will protect your best cards. Oh, thank you. Masterful. Thank you! Zinc bug is so nice to me compared to the stoat. Stoat's a fucking can. Hmm, stale fish. Hard shoes. Ant Queen. Hmm. Fresh. Choose. You hate ants? Well, we're gonna get more ants! Whether you like it or not. New fish, easy choose. Well, worker ant, you will sacrifice yourself for me? Thank you. Oh my god, I've already won the first round. Shit. <laughs> Go fish. No, the ant queen card, pog. Champ. I don't need bones. Great white. Go fish. Holy shit, they're fucking dead, mate. Fuck me! Huh. Squirrel, be my guide. Wait, Child 13 can fly now? And has two damage? Yo! Yo, 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 yo! Fuck! He evolved and I didn't even realize it? That's why he's a rare card. Yo, am I gonna win now? Let's see, one, two, three, four, five. It's all gonna go across. Yo, this is too fast. Are you... Need a light? Yeah, I'd like a candle, please. I did not expect to be that fast, my reward. Long elk? I have no words for this freak of nature. Can move to the right and then has a poison touch. But cannot be sacrificed according to this border here. Gek, which I guess will turn into a dragon later on, but has no sigil. Child 13, which I have already. Takes four bones to put down Long Elk, but seems pretty powerful. I like this more than Gek for now. Gek I will learn about in the future. You considered one of the anglers catches meal, but the rank odor deterred you. Dinner would have to wait. Oh god, I'm not even gonna be able to have dinner before volleyball, I'm gonna die. 
Let me think. Oh, that's nice. A frigid gust of wind billowed unwelcome into your lungs. COVID? I better eat something. I ate something at three, but I won't be able to eat until like nine. And you know me, I'm going to go straight to the bar. The beauty of the falling snow failed to distract you from the chill in your bones. You had ascended to the snow line. I'm going to get up. Yo, I like this this wind though. I like how the music changes in each level. But here are all the different sigils and the what it means. I have this boon. I would love to start with eight bones. I would love bones. But apparently there's lots of different items and abilities. But I need to figure out this puzzle. I don't know what this puzzle is. Someone's like outside. I don't know how this works. If anything about it works at all. Yeah, spooky game. I did these puzzles. I don't think there are anything new here, is it? Yeah, no, nothing new. Double checking to see if I didn't take anything out or if I missed something. What's up, dude? Oh, what is this? Extra teeth? Whoa, 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 whoa! The wolf? I just took out the wolf? Big wolf? I don't know when the next time you'll play volleyball is. I hope it's soon, but I did not see the wolf coming out of his cage. Where do I put the wolf now? Can't put the wolf back in there. I'm holding the wolf. Does the wolf go in here? Guys, I got a knife. You finally pried my special dagger from the paws of that squirrel. Though you may wish that you hadn't. Die, bitch! What the fuck am I gonna do with the, the knife, though? Hmm. I'm trying to see if there's anything else I can interact with. Can I cut one of these ropes? Wait, the clock changed or did I do that? Oh, these are my items. I have my goat, I have a knife, and my bones, and these lovely eyes. Cave. Don't need items. I could make a new card. You arrived at the inky black mouth of a cave. My... my pussy? A strange beast lurked within. It spoke, pass one of my trials and I'll be yours in a raspy voice. <laughs> Three creatures will be drawn from your deck. They will decide your success or failure. What the fuck? A loot box? But first, you will choose a trial. God, why did I do this? Un de trois. Trial of blood. The three drawn cards must cost at least four combined to pass. Uh, the trial of wisdom. The three drawn cards must have at least, at least three sigils among them to pass. 
The trial of health, the three drawn cards must have six health combined to pass. All my cards have sigils except for one, two, three. So my probability of doing the sigil test is a lot better than the rest of them. So let's fucking do it, mate. One, two, three, zero. Yes! I was so lucky with this one. The double sigil. The beast revealed itself. It was. River Otter with three blood. River Snapper with Ant Pog. Warren with changing. Oh my god, this looks fucking neat. Rabbit Hole, when a card bearing the sigils played, a rabbit is created in your hand. A rabbit is defined as no power, one health. Ah. And it transforms after one? I need it. This looks so cool. The inhabited Warren, join your menagerie. Dude, freaky, but cool. The stink bug changed its face. The choice is yours. Mad weird. I want bifurcated strike on one of my other cards. I just want to see which one it'll let me put it on. I could put it on all of these. Imagine if I put it on the wolf. Or child 13. Honestly, I kind of want to put it on child 13 because it's going to evolve after one turn and do four damage. And it's only one blood to put down. Jeremiah was a bullfrog. Hello. Thank you, boy. Bye, Mantis. test it out. Hopefully I get to draw that card. Nope. What are they going to send me? Raven eggs, elk fawn, moves, transforms. All of these will transform after one turn. I don't like this. I have to put the bullfrog down. I need to do guarding against flying, so the bullfrog will just have to tank. I guess a hit? I need to put the possum down to kill. And I'm not, I don't know if I want to sacrifice them both yet. What does this knife do? To use, you will place the weight on the scales. The pain is temporary. Oh, fuck that. Oh, fuck. Right, die. I didn't get an extra blood from sacrificing that dude with three three balls on his cock. Why did I put the ant queen there? Shit. Because I could have taken out so many of these things. I could have taken out a flyer. I could have taken an ant queen. I should have put the ant queen here. This is a bad move. I 
I'm fucked up again. Squirrel tank. Tysa! Child 13 takes a bone. Don't have anything to sacrifice. Don't want to sacrifice that. I will get four. They will do five on me. So I'm going to be another. I'm going to be in the hole. No, I won't be in the hole. It'll be net. It'll be bad. Doesn't do any damage though. <laughs> Lucky draw, thank god. No, that's the only play I had! Shut up! See? Don't! Trying to fuck with me, huh? Too close. Combine six health. I have very few cards with one health. This one is the hard. Bones I definitely cannot do. Or blood. Since I have pretty much split between them. The word blood? One. Yeah, no, I think my best option now is the health one. Let the trial of health begin. Yes, Grizzly! Two from the Warren, one from the Obobobobo, and six from the Grizzly. They have passed. Give me a good card, please. Mole. Mole cannot be killed. We'll dive in, or I can sacrifice as many times as I need. Bifurcated worker ant with mole. I kind of want tanky mole rat. I love the infinite sacrifice. I don't need another Rat King. Cost too much to put down. on somebody but somebody cheap like somebody that costs bones and then they could take bones is that crazy that's crazy talk river otter with bones pink with bones why am i so consumed with bones i mean i am gay I do love a dick Maybe somebody that can't be attacked after they attack? So I think I want to put this to merges itself, also merges attacks its owner directly. I would do it on the Ant Queen. Or would I want to do it on somebody that has low, low HP? I think I want to put it on my, my card. So, River Otter with my card. That way it's guaranteed evolution. How many trees? Man? 
burrow and then leap. I can't put anything down with my cards. Yeah, but he can't, he just tanks, he can't attack. The moose is going to take this out in two turns and then move over. It's really all I can do. Hi, Gabby! I need a squirrel. The moose buck is seven health and it's going to get stopped by that tree. How much damage does it do? Three? What is this? Six? I want this to evolve. I have to put the squirrel down. I don't want to put the wolf down yet because the wolf is just going to get fucked by this buck. Knuck if you buck. Long Elk has poison damage. I'm going to use the Long Elk. Let's go. Cool. He gained one attack, I think? I don't remember. He's sucking his own cock, so he's supposed to get better as time moves on. He can't attack, he can't attack, so I will just do another damage to this. And what's going to come on? Another Elk. Is gonna do two damage to my elk, which might die. He can't move. I could potentially kill this and get it out of my deck and put a wolf down so after it attacks, it will move. Okay, so that will attack, do some damage, and then this will clear the space. The elk will come down, but my elk will move. I think I'll be okay. I haven't done any damage across. Can't put Orobobo down. I can hold on this to for now, but Look at the elk popping out. Is it doing less and less damage as time moves on? God, what the fuck are these cards that I just got? Anyways, um, tank. It's about to die. Kinda, sort of. Feels like it. Do I get rid of it? So I can kill the fawn? Kill it. This won't die, but it'll kill me. Oh, this just sucks, this sucks. You killed the tree. I negate, whatever. The child can come and do some massive damage in the middle. Oh, it won't do damage, but it won't die. Each time it dies, it gets stronger because it sucks its own cock. But I'm just going to do immediate damage to it and kill it, so I should be okay. Oh, because I'm doing it in that weird double way, I forgot. One. Worker ant. Thank God. The unkillable worker ant. 
Child 13 is dead? Chaisa. Uh, if I get a bone card, I'll be fine, but then it'll do four damage. I'll do three and I'll win the game. I'm stuck. Hi, Kathy. Hope you're doing well. This, this game is fun to me. But I have to play. I have to get ready for volleyball in about ten minutes. Elk, raven egg, and nascent raven. It is no less conniving in its incubation. Kingfisher, adept, a slippery hunter. Don't care for it. I don't want the elk card. I'm not good at movement because there's never any space on my deck. I could use one item. I could use two items. You got high. You masturbated and took a long nap, ready to take on the night. I'm not ready to masturbate yet. I called my doctor and I was like, can you give me some stuff? And he was like, yeah, I'll give you some stuff. And I was like, thank you. $20. That pitiful possum. Frozen Opossum Bottle. To the user, Frozen Opossum is created in your hand, and a Frozen Opossum is defined as zero power, five health, frozen away. What does the frozen part mean, though? Ice Cube. When a card is bearing the sigil, perishes. The creature inside is released in its place. That's kind of cool. I don't know if I want it as an item. Uh, he gave me some antibiotics. Frozen possum, though, kind of fucking cracks me up. Like, I don't even know how good the possum card is, but I want it just to fuck around with it, but it's only an item, and I can't sacrifice it yet. And it's really there to just tank hits for me. Do No, I do have a possum. The possum is two bones and kind of weak and kind of dumb. My doctor doesn't think what the condition I have is an issue, but I'm like, I don't want to gamble, and also those antibiotics will do wonders for my face. They hurt. Anything that is bird will hurt me if I attack it. So taking more than one turn, not a great idea. Ouroboros is still keeping its strength from when it last sucked its cock? Pretty neat. Hi, Zara Jar. <laughs> Thank you for, for subscribing for three months. Mwah. Thank you so much. That sub money will go towards paying for my doctor visits. <laughs> because sexual health is important. Yay, important. Fuck. I hate this. I have to put down the cocksucker. Get on that prep. Get on it. Fuck him up, sis. Ah, oh, God. I will do five damage, negating one hit of damage. This will evolve, so it might be three. I need a squirrel in hand. I'll pick up a card next time around. Oh, fucker! 
Forgot about that. Shit. My up queen. She's gonna fucking fly over me. Kinda stuck. But I have to kill it. Because then when I attack it, it's going to hurt me back one. Minus one. I could sustain that. Barely. Shit. But where do I put the worker ant that does two damage? These things are gonna fly over me, kill me, and I'm gonna lose the next round because I am what? Fucking stupid. What did I do? My eye? Oh, fucking what, mate? I had to gouge my eye out and I can't even see the right side of the port anymore. No matter what I do. Oh, he does four. I'm still dead. Lost. And I gouged my eye out. I lost. I should have just straight up lost and not gouged my fucking eye out. Believe it or not, you're not the first to lose an eye here. This isn't much fun if you're half blind. Perhaps you'd like to replace it. I get to pick an eye. Better? Regardless. The voice is final. Well, I'm done playing today. I gotta go prepare for volleyball. 
wrap up my knees, go set up a net, play at eight, not eat, get fucking drunk, and then some. Thank you all for watching. I'll be back tomorrow. I actually want to continue playing this tomorrow instead of playing some Pokemon Unite. So maybe I'll start Pokemon Unite at 4.30 and then play this game an hour later at 5.30. All times Eastern. <laughs> Let us see, it saved 42 seconds ago. Have a great night. Peace out. Make sure you take care of your sexual health and get tested regularly. Bye. Pay into your pets.